I want you to show your love for this gentleman. He goes by the name of Abraham. He's in the building. Put your hands together. Show your love for Abraham. Show your love. He's there. I never figure out what I'm going to do until I get on stage, so I usually draw a blank, so I apologize for that. Um, Alright, this this piece, this next piece, I uh, don't really have a title for it, but uh deals with belief and sort of the blinding side effect that so, sometimes comes along with belief in the sense that uh, when, you, when you believe in something, it kind of, you kind of... Don't look at anything, any other possibilities, anything else that may be out there. You say, all right, this is what I believe in, this is true. And it's sort of blindness to, to, to any other possibility. Um, so I guess that's the overall theme of this. Growing up, you would have thought that baseball was our favorite sport. Because my best friends had a few strikes against them. Everyone was pitching, and the stick-up kids tried to catch it coming home slipping. So shit wasn't safe, even though the fiends were on base. We had faith, just not like you used to, but around here it's the usual. Little homie once told me the gun was his religion. It made sense, since it's always court, and never church when they calling for a witness. But we're forced to live this way, so we won't pray for forgiveness. We ain't asked for none of this. I was once told life was a punishment. The answer was lost, but I swear that I found it. I now see that some get high so they can fly. Forget that they're grounded. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change and help them understand that my flaws make me who I am. I think with my heart when I speak my mind, so at times, my emotions get the best of me. And when they do, I hope you don't think less of me because I mean what I say and I say what I think is right. I've always been that way, a young JFK. They tell me to be careful, and at times I feel like I really ought to, cause NYC could be my daily plaza. But see, I toss caution to the wind to block the orphans from the wind, cause life ain't always what it seems. We've been living a nicotine dream. I'm scared of to turn my heart black. See, I've always been a little different. I was told the eyes are windows, although mine are tinted, and my soul is vintage. The world rests at the base of my neck, burden weighing heavy on my chest, and it don't feel right, cause broken dreams don't heal right. Regardless, I still write, cause words are the weapons I use as protection from the demons. Yeah, I seen them in my own eyes, was once a victim of my own lies, but I'm thankful, cause some died and were victims their whole lives. We live in an age of deceit. You have to be aware of the lessons they teach. We're born with our consciousness open, but sadly, we're conditioned to close it. But I'm claustrophobic. I gave my mind space and seceded from that mind state. Because ignorance is malignant, and I refuse to let that tumor grow. Although I used to live in that place within my mind, I even took a trip back. Afraid of what I might find because it's been so long since I've been home. I was out throwing stones. I blacked out and forgot I once lived in a glass house. See, for so long I was zoned out, but I realized it was I that shattered my own house. Because I realized these structures are no more than false and fragile systems of belief that bind us, confine us, don't allow us to grow. I learned to live life like water <coughs> and just allow it to flow. See, the search for knowledge and understanding is infinite. But see, what beliefs do is deceive you. And through that deceit, you falsely believe that journey's complete. See, as I stood among the shards of broken pieces, I realized people build walls around their beliefs, afraid to have them stand out. But these ain't stones. These are gems that I toss at your glass house. Thank you. CD, um, I don't like to say it's for sale, just uh, donations. You know, um, it, there's no set price, whatever you want to give, whatever you can give. The title of the CD is called uh, Nerd the Cool Taste, and it's about standing out, being who you are, never compromise yourself to fit in with the crowd. You know, uh, never be afraid to be that nerd at the cool table. And it's, uh, it's a musical CD as well as poetry, um, all different genres, ranging from. Uh, Soul, hip hop, uh, jazz, I got it all on there. So, like I said, if you want to support 
all funds go goes towards uh, fund all everything goes towards funding my other projects as well as a nonprofit organization that we're going to get off the ground inside of the Artist Collective and this free art project where we uh, have uh, free uh, workshops and open mics and, and showcases that are free and open to the public. So if you'd like to know more about that, come see me afterwards and I'll, I'll let you know. Thank you. Most possess the potential. They just lack the essential utensils. But I drop gems. So you should use the jewels that I lend you. First off, Forget all you were taught. There's a need. I believe I can help spark an original thought. Cause I create constant friction with my conscious diction. So you no longer have to be a contradiction. Just living and die. See, there's more to life before it passes. And the masses, they're not blind. They can see through their eyes. Their vision is just blurry. But no need to worry. Cause I spit such descriptive scriptures that they paint perfect pictures. And once you better your vision, you can make better decisions to better your living. Because my words give birth to revolutionary ideas and the thoughts of my peers. You're impregnated off the mere presence of my soul. I got that immaculate conception flow. I'm exceptional, but they fear me because I resemble my father. Brain of a scholar, heart of a martyr. See, my pops had a way with words. He used it to chase the girls. I'll use it to change the world. Because once my compassion is lit, nothing surpasses my passion is spit. It's enough to go around. No need to ration this shit. But see, I like to take a break from my story and recognize all those that God called up before me. Can I please have a moment of silence for those lost to unnecessary violence? Rest in peace to William Cooper especially. Murdered in cold blood by Apache County deputies, you were, but most only pretend to be. And for that, I'm picking up where you left off. And for Malcolm and Martin King, I'm doing the same thing. But see, I'm not named dropping for the applause. I'm just trying to show you what you lost. And see, I got some pretty big shoes to fill, but they fit me just fine. And I ain't even hit my prime. Throughout time, they've been playing the same sad song. And we ain't even call up and request it. They say the truth is hard to swallow and even harder to digest it. I learned you don't have to live it at all to die by the sword. And even a pawn has potential to become the most powerful piece on the board. It's just that many people are stuck in their ways. Afraid to break a bill because they can't handle change. I'm just trying to show you a way. Not the path that I see fit. The one you pay for yourself once you learn this shit. But see, you got to beware of those trying to distract you with an illusion of truth. That's what illusioners do. See, some things can't be proven. So here's a pen and a pad, you draw your own conclusion. I got my philosophy, but they can't properly interpret my ideology. So they pass it off as arrogance. Please, don't get it confused like most do. I'm destined for greatness, it's so true, but then again, so are you. Thank you. If you listen and you learn in time that any fool can learn from their mistakes, I'm here to help you learn from mine. They want my words confined, held captive, not active, prisoner of my own <coughs> mind, but I write to release it. It's dark in a part of my heart. I write in sight of the light to defeat it. I write for the parolees and OGs, the movers and shakers in a world filled with killers and rapists. It's for the black and brown babies born with toe tags attached to them. I write and hope to subjugate the murder rate. I don't write to acquire change, I write to inspire change. Cause I'm among those who would rather be a peasant with a heart of gold than a king that sold his soul. I write for those that didn't know that currency was infectious. They were dead broke. They thought the money could resurrect them. It caught felonies off a hard grind. I write for those who fell on these hard times. It's for that child lost, without a cause. They figure why bother. They never had a care, cause they never had a father. It was on a path to destruction. They were on the verge, and, and they learned they was born of a virgin. See, it's hope, and we need this. Some like Jesus, but we fall victim to the deception. The hood is filled with products of immaculate conception. 
Also write for the heretics and suspected terrorists just because they're speaking in Arabic. Allah patuk ya aina, mo'adin basidin befreitna. Translation, God gave life, provided opportunity for unity through free thought, presenting the vision, and we're missing with man created religion. Listen, I write for those that sold their soul for a couple stacks. I'll show you how to flip that, then buy it back. Cause if it's God's knowledge that you desire, why bother your soul for the devil to acquire? I will do belahi min a shaitan and ajim. I write for every poem ever lost that is guarded. For every poem who never got started. I write in memory of those ahead of their time. Cause I know most of us die ahead of our prom. I write cause your mind is in prison. But if you listen, these words will set you free after the brain. I got a purpose. I let these other artists spit for entertain. Thank you. Yeah. Shout out to Abraham, the poet. Once again, show your love for him. He's been rocking out for three years with us. Next up, I'm gonna call to the stage. This is gonna go by the name of Anne Zinge. Please come to the stage, Anne Zinge. Am I saying your name right? You are not oh, cool, but what is? What's the name? Anne what? 